Lightning L Drago. The Forbidden Left Rotation Bay was without a doubt one of the most popular Beyblades ever released. Everything about this Beyblade was pure peak, from its unique stunning design, its performance, to its appearance in the Beyblade Metal Fire anime and manga. This Beyblade was truly sensational. With the 25th anniversary of the Beyblade franchise closely approaching, I thought that this would be the perfect time to drop this video, especially since Lightning L Drago won the remake vote for Metal Fight Beyblade. For those of you who aren't familiar with the remake vote that was hosted earlier this year by Takara Tomy, this remake vote was a part of Takara Tomy's Royal 25th Anniversary crossover project. In this project, Takara Tomy will revive or recreate base from previous series into the latest generation, Beyblade X. And luckily for us, instead of recreating these bays at random, Takara Tomy allowed us fans to vote for the bays we'd like to see be made in X from Baki Tenchu, from Metal Fight, and Burst. In the final phases of this voting campaign, the vote was narrowed down to selecting the top 10 bays for each generation, with our Lightning L Drago coming out on top to be the first bay from Metal Fight Beyblade to be remade in Beyblade X. I am so freaking hyped, man. Lightning L Drago is going to be a demon in Beyblade X. Lightning L Drago 100 Hole Flat is a less spin attack type Beyblade that was released on July 18th, 2009 in Japan by Takara Tomy. Lightning was later distributed through Hasbro for international audiences in 2010. Lightning L Drago was the first L Drago Beyblade to be released into the hybrid wheel system, as it was the successor to the original. El Drago 105 flat from the first and original system in Metal Fight Beyblade, the Metal System. Y'all already know who owned Lightning El Drago, but for those of you who don't, allow me to introduce you to the Black Air Force Demon of Beyblade, the Dragon Emperor himself, Ryuga. Guys, Ryuga was him. From his first introduction in the anime, we knew Ryuga was about that balance. This guy was a menace. Now for real guys, in his first episode, he was talking more trash than Yusuke and Vegeta. Ryuga was fully trash talking. The things Ryuga said to Jinga about his dad was a different kind of disrespectful. Like nah man, I didn't know whether I should be feeling bad for Jinga or if I should be laughing. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, but this level of violation was just profoundly insulting. Not only did Raigo defeat Jingo in the most embarrassing way possible, but he left him with that emotional damage. This scene and episode was amazing. But what made this sequence really hit though was the next episode, episode 14. In this flashback episode, it was revealed the Forbidden Bay Lightning El Drago was sealed in Koma Village. Which begs the question, how on earth did Lightning El Drago come into Raiga's possession if it was sealed? The simple answer, murder, plain and simple murder. For Raiga to obtain the Forbidden Beyblade, he had to break into where it was sealed of course, and Lightning El Drago was sealed in Jinga's hometown, Koma Village. After Raiga successfully managed to obtain Lightning El Drago, after invading Koma Village with his private military, he encountered the guardian and protector of Lightning El Drago and the previous owner of Storm Pegasus, Jinga's father, Ryo Hagane. Bro, this was so sad, man. Raiga looked at Ryo like he was about to be El Drago's first victim. He proceeded to create a stadium instantly using El Drago, which is a crazy feat in itself. Bear in mind that there's lava literally beneath them, like they're having this bay battle inside a volcano. Bro, the first season of Beyblade Metal Fight was too wild. But nah, Ryuga fodderized Ryo bad. He clapped him with ease, bro. That beat that was disrespectful. Bruh, he even ripped off Ryo's headband and he used it to clean his Lightning El Drago. Like El Drago taught something dirty, the level of disrespect was profound. With the volcano starting to collapse around them, Ryo used the last of his strength to pass on his Storm Pegasus to Jinga as Ryo was crushed by the rubble. Was this truly the end of Ryo Hagane? Who knows, I'm not spoiling that. But literally everything I just explained to you guys was Ryuga's and El Drago's introduction to the anime. Which is crazy, this is why El Drago and Ryuga, that dynamic duo, they are the Black Air Force menaces of Beyblade. 
they are crazy. Like, how can you beat up a Protag's dad in front of him? Potentially even killing him as well? Nah, Ryuga was devious. From Ryuga blitzing Hikaru and giving her PTSD in the process to crushing Tsubasa in the most embarrassing way possible and his epic brutal showdown against Kiyoya in the semi-finals of the Battle Bladers tournament. Ryuga was too freaking cold. He had so many awesome scenes and battles in Beyblade Metal Fusion. As for the Metal Fight manga, the origin behind Ryuga obtaining El Gravel from Koma Village was more or less the same, with the main difference being, instead of Ryuga obtaining Lightning El Drago, Ryuga obtained the original El Drago 105 flat from the metal system. Ryuga evolves his El Drago 105 flat into Lightning El Drago 100 hole flat in the manga after using Benkei's special move as a catalyst to evolve it. Lightning El Drago originally released with 5 main parts. These parts were the face bolt, the energy ring, also known as the clear wheel, the fusion wheel, also known as the metal wheel, the spin track, and the performance tip. The El Drago 1 face bolt depicts Draco, which is one of the 88 constellations in space. This face bolt features a dragon facing towards the left, with the words El Drago printed beneath it. Now we can't talk about Lightning El Drago without explaining both the El Drago Clear Wheel and the Lightning Metal Wheel. The El Drago Energy Ring, or Clear Wheel, just like the original El Drago Metal Wheel, features three dragon heads which form a circle. This Clear Wheel is less spin only and can only be used with a Lightning Metal Wheel. I freaking love this Clear Wheel because it takes the beautiful design of the original El Drago Metal Wheel and it gives it a fantastic gimmick as the metal wheel has now been separated into two parts these parts being the energy ring and the fusion wheel we now have the ability to rotate the dragon heads 180 degrees on the lightning fusion wheel allowing us to switch between two main modes these modes being the upper attack mode and the barrage attack mode also known as smash attack mode the Lightning Wheel is a Lesbian Fusion Wheel that features 6 main contact points and it's only compatible with the El Drago 1 Energy Ring. Lightning El Drago released with the 100 Spin Track. The 100 Spin Track is the third lower spin track in height, as the 100 Spin Track is taller than both the 85 and 90 Spin Tracks. The last part that originally released with Lightning El Drago is the whole flat performance tier. The whole flat performance tip has similar speed and movement to the original flat tip. However, due to the hole at the center of its performance tip, it has more stamina when compared to the original flat tip, as the whole flat tip has less grip on the stadium floor, resulting in more stamina. And that concludes today's episode on Lightning El Drago, everyone. So, did you enjoy this episode? If you did, let me know which bay we should cover next in the comments down below. And of course, don't forget to smash that like button down below. And if you're not subscribed yet, then be sure to smash that subscribe button as well. So are you guys hyped for Lightning El Drago to be remade in Beyblade X? I know I am man. Lightning El Drago is such a hard bay to fumble. A good example would be Beyblade Burst GT. Lightning El Drago was remade in that generation and it was so awesome. And going from our track record with Beyblade X so far, the first remake, Dronza S, was absolutely fantastic at release, unlike the back then shoot remakes in Beyblade Burst. So yeah guys, Beyblade X's quality seems to be great so far, which just gives me such strong hope for a great remake for our Lightning L Drago. This bay is going to be dominating the metal. This bay is going to be absolutely insane. So of course guys, let me know in the comments down below if you're hyped for Lightning El Drago to be remade in Beyblade X and if you're not, also let me know which bay you'd like to see be remade in Beyblade X. For example, I believe the top 5 bays to be remade were Lightning El Drago, Galaxy Pegasus, Meteor El Drago, Storm Pegasus and Rock Leon I think. That's just from the top of my head. I also think El Drago Destroy made it into the top 10. I might be wrong on that though. But yeah guys, like I said, that does conclude today's episode and I'd also like to give a tremendous shout out to everyone who has been supporting my channel thus far. You guys have been absolutely fantastic, but we're not done yet though. So next up, 
we have some crazy epic bay battles with Jeff featuring the Eldrago Beyblades. So be sure to stick around and enjoy some epic bay battles everyone. And as always, thanks for watching and peace out. We got another Evolution Bay battle. We got Pegasus Land versus Eldrago Land. So every time a Beyblade wins, okay not every time, every time a Beyblade wins three times I guess. We go down, go down an evolution. So essentially, um, whoever can get to the first evolution first, pre hybrid and win those last three rounds wins this evolution microphone. As your blade up, Jeff, he is going to take control of the Pegasus avatar and win. Of course, your boy is using fucking oh, car hearts, man. Who should meet like that? Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. what I'm saying. Three, two, two one. one. Oh, well, then. That's one nil. He said, out of here, boy. That's right. upper attack. Samurai's a bitch. I might as well. Uh, <laughs> can, I, can I change it to. To crystal what? Yeah. To find the baseball. Where's that? Is it going to work? Maybe. Maybe not. If we're going to find out. <laughs> but I'm going to use it in. Is it crystal or not crystal? Crystal up mode. Right. Three, two, two, one. Got better defense. Oh, okay. shit. Fair enough. The weight distribution. What tip is my man got? Left from the flat. It's the battle of the flats, the rubber flats. He's got to win. That weight, is, <laughs> that weight difference is <laughs> crazy. What was that? Am I going down one? Nah. No? I'm going down one if I win a round. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Three, Three, two, one. one. It, doesn't, it doesn't matter what. I can't <laughs> knock you out unless I get lucky with where I hit you. Come on, right, man. Right near the pocket. It's El Drago. Hey, Pegasus. I can't lie, you're not beating Guardian. <laughs> you're not beating Guardian. Gosh. I'm not beating <laughs> until. Meteor, probably. I mean, this is going to be a, a repeat of what happened with the Drones and Dragoons. Oh, yeah. Ish. Three, Three, two, two one. one. Pop out. I was like, still want smoke. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. I'm in it. It's a minute. Guardians, nothing. The way Pegasus is equalizing right now as well is kind of crazy. He's going to lose, but it's all cool to see. No, pull through, pull through. Wait, hold on. There's no way Pegasus is going to win. Pull oh, no. through. Okay, well, that'll yeah. I was about to yeah. save him. There's no way. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Just burn all your energy. That was a bad launch. Rest in peace, Samurai Pegasus. Hey, one, one hit for him. Go on, that is go, on. go on. Yeah, destabilize. There's no way. And again. Yeah. Okay, this is the, is this is where you just need to hope and pray now, guys. Come on, old Drago, you can win. Don't yes. lose. Bro. I, I, I got the last. No, no, I see got the point. 1-1, one, one, fair enough. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Ooh, I needed that. Hey, that was close, that was close, but... Then Destabilizing. Again, you want to equalize again. I mean, not if you don't touch me. <laughs> You're not... Yeah, yeah, that was it. 2-1. One. one more. One more win. 3-2-1. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right. It's 2-2. Two, two. Yeah. 3-2-1. Maybe bounce. And again. And again. Come and on, again. Guardian. Tack these hits. Where's this energy coming from, Pegasus? Where's this at the start? Pegasus! I can't lie. It's wraps the L Dragon if you make it onto me. I just need to destabilize, yes. Yes. Come on, L Dragon. <laughs> Bruh. There's no way. Hey, it's the Guardian loses. It's Jinkerson. all Guardian then. It's all on wing then. Oh, yeah. Wing oh, versus Guardian. I'm going to scrape. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Yeah, mate. You ain't got nothing now. You'll do nothing. That's are going crazy now. Dragon is down. Yeesh. Right, cool. Three, two, one. Don't scrape. 
I did a heavy launch. El Drago, avoid Wayne Pegasus if you want to survive, man, because you're going to lose. But the upper head The upper head score crazy. Mm. Which one's heavier? Do you know? Like it says a little wheel. Top of my head, absolutely no idea. Similar range, but I'd guess Guardian. Mm. Tornado is stalling at its finest. Stalling is a different kind of jarring, I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah, that's why I did, didn't really like it in the burst. Yeah. It's a cage for me, it was, just, it was just LAD, that was the metal. I think my lighter stalling combinations are more enjoyable. Yeah. But the 4D ones, nah. Mm -hmm. Too boring for me, I'm honest. Come on, and again, and again. Come on, Guardian. Yeah, I'm out. Spin. Yeah, Guardian is probably going to lose this round again. Ah, I knew it, man. What did I say? Watch me go into wing. I'm going to do a heavy level. launch. Give you a chance. I might straight, but I want to see a mad depth. 3, Three two, 2, 1. one. I, I tried to see a heavy hit. Try flower. What, with heavy spin? Yeah, why not? 3, 2, 1. The sad point is, you're probably going to win still. As long as I hit you at the right, yeah, stabilizing. Tiki Taka. Oh, Dragon Guardian, you have let me down. Yeah, Guardian, nothing. And Guardian starts to go down. Guardian is down, bro. Fair enough. Next so you're up. Big Bang next. Big Bang. Does the final drive work? Probably still. Yep. Three, two, one. Final drive! Nah, too early. I don't, I don't know, that it's runs a GT. High up here, man. Oh. Yeah. I'm going to go shot. Bruh. There's no, what? Go on, Pegasus. Nah, Star like Fragment. Is decent as well, man. It's a huge flat tip. Oh, Drago Guardian yeah. is getting bodied. Oh, Drago who? Oh, Drago what? Three, Three, two, two one. one. Guardian, man, come on, the win. Don't lose to this pump. And we lost. Easy, guys. easy. Can it be a clean sweep from Pegasus? We'll find out. Probably will be then. Three, Three two, two, one. Knock him out. Make it, make it a, a solid hit. That rubber's helping you, man. Yeah. Yeah, what a stamina I lose for the rubber touch to the stadium. Oh, it looks like oh, yeah, you might Drago. Win. You might win nah, it's metal ball, man. You might, you might win. It's metal ball, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Drago loses. Next up. Bruh. Pegasus. If you, if you don't knock this thing out, I have faith in my galaxy there. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Bruh, that's all I'm saying, man. Bruh. Three, Three two, two, one. one. And again. Look at that. The, the weight difference is crazy. If I don't win in the first five seconds, then, then you should know who wins. Nah, you know it's metal ball, man. Balance, guys. Yeah, it's too easy to stabilize. But the weight difference, you should still outspin. Nah, man. The way the weight is mm. so being spread out. It's not speeding on the edges, so. Nice. I'll no, take the win. Point, it's tilts when it's on all stamina. Yeah. Three, Three two, two, one. one. That was like a snipe. Does it count? No, it counts. I lost three times <laughs> in a row. I would never lost three times in a row, man. I was counting. I was counting. Against Galaxy. Nah. Again.
This is Dragoon GT all over again, man. Next up, we've got Storm, Storm Pegasus. Pegasus versus Guardian. Three, two, one. one. No way. And I wasn't even near the pocket, it was on the other side of the room. Guardian arena. is getting bloody. Three, Three, two, two one. one. What? Storm Pegasus? Storm Pegasus is bad, man. First release. Three, two, two one. one. And again, three, three knockouts. Oh, I got his hand. He's fighting, he's fighting. It's three knockouts. Oh, fuck's sake, what? man. Guardian is a who, fraud. Who would have thought Storm Pegasus versus Guardian would have been the most exciting Guardian one so far? Guardian is a bloody fraud, fam. All right, next up. I'm on my last one now, so if I can beat him, he just needs to carry on winning now. Oh, Otherwise, Christ, I win. Man. Three, two, one. one. Oh, I love the sound of that. I started pretty heavy base. Yeah. Top two. I think Bell's actually the same. Yeah, same. Similar size. Oh, that's close. Three, two, one. Oh, that's close. 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 Oh, that's Three. Guardian is stock sucks, man. Three, yeah, man. two, one. one. Knock him out. Oh, knock him out. We still win. Still win. I said knock him out. No. Come on, Guardian. Come on, Guardian. You can do it, man. So close to victory. victory Pegasus, I don't need to tell you what to do. So close, man. Just do your intake. And El Drago's probably gonna lose. El Drago has lost. Jesus Christ, man. You know what? This was fun. <laughs> pre hybrid versus pre hybrid, man. Come on. Whoever wins, whoever wins these these two battles wins it all. Three, two, two one. one. Get out, pop up. Oh, one nil, one nil. Can he blame it all back? Three. Comment down for this. Two, one. Knock him out. Return. Eesh. One, one. Final round. Three, Three two, two, one. one. That under here. Yes. You want to do another one for luck? Uh, yeah, why not? Why not? <laughs> Three, <laughs> two, two, one. one. Knock him out. Ah. Not, no, not literally knock it out. Alright, no, no, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do my Storm Pegasus. There were some crazy hits with that. Three. Two, two, one. Hit him out. Again. 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 El Drago. You can do it, man. Equalize spin still. Do what you gotta do to win, man. Pegasus, play it smart now. You're in, Don't you're let in, Pegasus you're in the win danger zone. Right. Stall him out. Is it a whole flat that you've got on? Yeah, HF. And I think for LAD. Pegasus, man, there's no way it's gonna win. Come on. Oh, Drago! Pegasus! Wait, let me tell. Bro. Oh. <laughs> Ten. Three, two, one. That is. You said pinpoint accuracy, foul. Oh, Drago said. Oh, bitch. <laughs> uh, come face me, come face me. Say no more. Three, two, two one. one. Yeah, yeah, beating me. Knock him out. Three hits. One, two, three. Oh. No way, I'm losing. The two lowest ones. What spin track is it? 90? No, 105. Yeah. Just Same stuff for Pegasus. Wait, yeah. I think Orago might be, bro. But then again, it's because of the slope for so long. That's yeah, that's what I mean. Like the yeah. yeah, rematch, rematch, rematch. Run it back. Run it back. Three, Three two, one. New challenger. Out of here. Get out of here. Absolutely bullied. Jesus. You know what? Put it in again. Go on. Okay. Pause there. Your funeral. Knock him out. What? Tag team. Focus as you got this. 
<laughs> no way. Pegasus! Fuck it up then. Final round, I'll go with the destroy it. Actually, no, no, not final round, I have the Meteor yet. Yeah. I'm still sticking with. Fair enough. I'll go with the Meteor then. 3, 2, 1. one. That rubber ain't gonna help you here, boy. Oh, Meteor. Yeah, I thought it was hot. Now we all know who's going to win out of these two. <laughs> what? Ah. What? Oh, this is Jesus Christ. 